Cheryl was on her way back home to Grace Living Center just down the street when she says two men walked out from behind Whitaker's and approached her asking for directions. We're a local store. We basically know all of our customers by name. Cheryl Reynolds is one of those regulars. She says she comes to this shopping plaza almost every day. I was getting bird feed that day and some soda pop. It's just a nice little walk, actually. Last week was one of those routine trips until she made it out to the parking lot. It wasn't long before she noticed she was being followed by two young men. They started out asking for directions and ended up demanding her purse. And he got mad at me and said, let go of the purse. And he took me and just slammed me around. Police say the same two young men are seen here in surveillance video moments before Cheryl was robbed. She said she thought she was being cautious when she wrapped her purse around her walker. The walker went flying up in there too and spilled uh, my bird feed and all that. It was out here in the street. She didn't suffer any serious injuries but was taken to the hospital. With no arrest made yet, she says she's frightened but not broken. There's a special place in hell for them boys. That's what I tell them, but this more than that is what I would want to do to them. I'd like to throw them down and kick the crap out of them, but I can't. I'd go to jail. Cheryl's not comfortable walking on her own to the supermarket today, but when she is, management here at Whitaker say they're more than willing to escort her to and from the assisted living facility. Reporting in Oklahoma City, Chris Gilmore, News 9.